Hi guys, welcome to the new series of SQL interview question. In this series, we will be talking about only the important interview questions from SQL. And this series is for both CSE and non-CSE student. Now, let's jump into this video. As you can see on my screen, you can see the agenda over here. And these are the only important questions which we are going to cover. So now let's move next. Here you can see we are first finding the second highest salary. And this is really a popular question among interviewer. So how to calculate? There are multiple, multiple way to calculate second highest salary. What you are seeing on the screen is a general approach. That means you can use this approach on SQL Server or MySQL. Now the non-CSE student will be asking, what do you mean by you can use this approach in SQL Server and MySQL? What is called general approach? So what I'm telling you over here, as we know, we have multiple DB options. Just like any programming language, DB has also, you know, it has their own syntax or keywords. Now, if you see this approach, if you are using this approach for MySQL or SQL Server, it is going to work on both. Now let's understand this. While you are running any, any SQL query, then first the inner query will be running. And what is the inner query? Select max salary from employee. So while you are going to run this query, the first query that will be running is select max salary from employee and the max salary as you can see this is the table where I have an ID salary ID is one two three salaries 2k 7k and 5k so the max salary would be 7k now the outermost query that is select max salary from employee where salary not in not in 7000 so what is the max salary apart from 7000 that is 5k so it is going to give me the second highest salary that is 5k now let's come to the second approach here we are doing now first go and jump into the inner query inner query what it is saying select max square max salary from employee that will be 7k now the max salary from employee where salary is less than the max salary what is the max salary which is less than 7k that is a 5k so in both the while you are running both the query you are going to get the same result now let's see the other approach the other approach you can see it on my screen for mysql and sql server it has their own keywords right now for mysql you can solve this same question using limit as well and for SQL Server, you can solve the same question by using top. So first check the MySQL one. Select salary from from select salary from employee order by salary descending limit to. Limit means whatever the number of limit we are going to give, the result is going to be the exact same amount means if you are giving limit 2 means it is going to fetch only 2 rows if you are going to give limit 3 it is going to fetch 3 rows if you are going to give limit 1 it is going to fetch 1 rows now in my sql now let's see the first inner query in inner query as you can see select star from select salary from employee order by salary descending order order by is a clause order by is used for while you are arranging a record in either ascending or descending by default it is in ascending order so for to make it in descending order you need to give descending desc after order by so that's why what we are doing in the inner query we are ordering the record in the descending order so for first 7k will come then 5k and then 2k so now my second query which will be running and it is going to give me the result 7k and 5k limit 2 means it is going to give me the two record 7k and 5k now the outer query jump to the outer query it has two record now the jump to the outer query outer query is saying select salary from whatever the inner query and the limit is 1 it is not men mentioning it ascending or descending because it is automatically ascending once you are not defining descending now the limit is one means it is going to give me 
इट इज सेवन के फाइव के लिमिट इज वन एसेंडिंग ऑर्डर फाइव के सेवन के लिमिट इज वन वॉट इट इज गोइंग टू गिव मी द फाइव के रिकॉर्ड सो दिस इज फॉर माई एस क्यूएल लिमिट नाउ लेट्स जम्प टू द एस क्यूएल सर्वर इट इज एज सिंपल एज दैट सेलेक्ट टॉप वन सैलरी फ्रॉम नाउ लेट्स जम्प टू द इनर क्वेरी फर्स्ट विल रिजॉल्व द इनर क्वेरी सेलेक्ट टॉप टू फ्रॉम employee order by salary in descending order now it is same as limit it is going to be give going to give me the top two result in the descending order so 7k 5k now the outer query will say no give me the one record top one record and that should be in ascending order now it will be reverting and it is going to give me top one that is 5k so both the query you can see it on my screen it is as simple as that so that's all if you guys like this video don't forget to press thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and keep learning thank you guys thank you for watching